TGR. What is up, Rudy? And what is up, everybody? It's your boy Onyx, and I already said my boy. <laughs> what's up? What's up? What's up? Oh man, oh, man. I am, I excited, am man? so excited, dude! I'm excited for this. I, I've been grinding yeah. away slowly, um, reaching master rank seventy. Um, so I, I have a lot to go, but I'm looking forward to this yeah. event for one specific monster. Yeah. Dude, Lucent. Lucent Nargu dude, like, yeah, I, yeah. you hyped me up when we covered all these animals, so I, or animals, yeah. monsters, but you know I'm hey, excited hey, for it. Know, it. They pretty much are favorites. animals. They, you know, they, they, they kind of are. Like, There's this really interesting video that I saw about the anatomy and like, uh, not anatomy, the biology, right, mm -hmm. uh, of these of these monsters, right? And one thing that people think, right, this is obviously not exactly about the event, but hey, why not talk about Monster Hunter a little bit? Um, there's this idea that, you know, you think of Monster Hunter and like, it's not fantasy right it's also not science fiction but it falls more in line with that you know mm -hmm. because these monsters are all based on in the world that they that they live in like there's no crazy high-tech anything mm -hmm. it's all the, the the equipment they use is it comes from the monsters and they're mm -hmm. not exactly magic because everything has its meaning Right? right, the electricity comes from this part of, of as an ogre. Val's tracks has the jet engines because of a certain part of its biology. It's all mm. made to be very natural, which is super cool. That that's part of the appeal of Monster Hunter. It's not fucking sci-fi. It's not magic. It's not fantasy. It's just the biology of this world. That's just the natural way of things. Very very cool. So. Uh, Whatever. I am excited for losing Nugger Kuga. <laughs> uh, dude, I hope that they do him right. Uh, he was one of the toughest monsters in 3U. Uh, like, I've said it before in one of my videos, but that dude kicked my ass and my brother. Uh, my, my and my brother's asses, because it just, it's just... You have to deal with so much crap. Mm -hmm. Not only the invis, but the constant poison prog, but the constant, mm -hmm. like... He's very aggressive, too. He does, like... It's just a pain in the ass. I really hope that Ryze does him justice. I need... If we don't fail a quest once, I'm going to be a little upset. I'm not lying to you. I, I know wire bugs make your hunter super strong, but uh -huh. I'm still going to be upset because I lost so much. I lost the, so many times, man. I mean, the anomalies alone, like, they're pretty difficult, uh, in my yeah. opinion. So I, I, I like yeah. it. I like the difficulty factor yeah. of things. Last night, like, I was hunting and I, like, I triple carded on a freaking Camellios, and I was just oh, like, oh, my, I need, I need to go to good. sleep. I need to go to sleep. I'm tired, man. <laughs> No, but yeah, so we'll see. And one other thing that I do want is, because um, it's going to begin very shortly here. One thing that I do want um, is what did they with with the first title update for Rise? If you remember, right. they announced a couple monsters, but then they kind of teased something else and they didn't right. say anything. And right, then when right, people right. played it, oh, here's Basil just kind of mm -hmm. showing up and, sh and wrecking shit. People are expecting Devil Joe. And while that would be cool, uh, it personally, I love Devil Joe. I think it would take away from the hype because Devil Joe has already been brought as a surprise monster, literally in its original uh, release in Try, and then again right. in in, in uh, Iceborne. He was the first right. title update in Iceborne, if I remember correctly. Or mm -hmm. maybe, why well, was Iceborne? It had to be Iceborne, but whatever. Somebody so, will correct us in the comments, it's fine. Yeah, yeah, right, exactly, yeah, let us know. But anyway, guys, we're about to start this bad boy in any second now, so let's catch you in that reaction, my boy. Mm -hmm. Oh, T14, this has blood and violence, Rudy. Oh, the bid rate. <laughs> oh, the bid rate. Oh, God, oh. man, it's so bad. Guys, this isn't how it looks on Switch, I promise. <laughs> YouTube compression. Oh. Seriously, man, it is bad. <laughs> oh, man. I still haven't gone to Scorn Magnamalo, by the way. Me neither. It's very sad. <laughs> I know, I know. Freaking adulting, man. Yeah, dude, adulting and, and honestly, the grind takes it takes a while to get to it. Like, right, right, you right. You had right. like two hunts, two to three hunts, normal hunts to get. Oh, look at losing! Look at losing! Oh, sorry. sorry. But yeah, you got to like two or three hunts to just level up once. It's it's rough. It's right. Rough. But here we go, baby. August Digital. Now, let's see what they have for us. What are you gonna do to keep me glued to this game? Hi everyone. Hi I'm everyone. I'm Yozo Tsujimoto, producer on the Monster Hi. Hunter series. Hello, I'm Yoshitake Suzuki, director of Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak. It's been a month mm. since the game's release, and we're happy to see... Oh, no, yeah. Has it been a, a month already? Thank you very yeah. much. Yeah, came on in June. Dang, dude. We've received a lot wow. of feedback from the fans. I went by fast. Very. Very thankful for that. 
This has made us extra motivated to work on the updates. I'm glad. Speaking of which, today we are here to tell you about free title update one, version 11. I'm excited, baby! <laughs> well, here we go. <laughs> Let's have a look. At Let's look at the first trailer. Let's go. All right. It's got to be Lucian. It's got to be Basil. But what else? Show us what else. I can't wait to find this in this uh, arena. Oh, yeah. The new arena is coming out. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was Silver Lowe's. I'm pretty sure that was Silver Rathos. Yes! Wow! Oh! oh, dude. Tell me about this, because I know nothing. It's, it's, it's a Silver Rathos. It's just a fucking super tough Rathos. That's exciting! <laughs> and we should also get Gold Rathian. There you go. Yep. Oh, wait. That... Are there any like special like uh, properties to them or? They just, they're, they're aggressive. They have slightly different moves and shit. Oh my God, Poison Rain. Oh dear God. Woo! That's a new move. Poison Rain? Never seen that before, yep. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Here it comes! Oh, Here it comes! Oh, Weekly dude. event quest starting August 18th. Okay, cool. So we're bringing okay, back event right. quest. That's nice, nice. Nice, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. Oh my God, fighting both at the same time is going to be hell. That'll be oh. fun to be talking about. Maybe some layered armor, baby. Oh, nice, that's nice. <laughs> T sure does take the edge off. It does. Oh god. Oh god. New afflicted, afflicted monsters. Oh, uh, dude. Afflicted Sinogre scares me. Oh my god, dude. The, oh, right here we go. The the yeah. The investigations. Increase the quest level. They take on more powerful monsters. What in the hell? Huh? How are they getting more powerful? Like more quest details are ten minutes random. There's a new upgrade system too. What? Yeah, we're gonna need some more explanation on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. like, what what's gonna make him harder? Just more damage? Right. right. This is solid. Four new monsters. Yeah. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, that's that's good. That's good. It's a good start. Good start. Agreed. Agreed. Free title update one, version eleven, for Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak. We'll Tomorrow or August tonight, depending yeah. on the time. Right, right, right. Today, we'll go in like eight or nine p.m. tonight or something. So stay tuned. Stay tuned. I'll be I'll be honest with you, man. The most I'm excited for is Lucent or Goku. Of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. S Silver Lois and Goldie, Golden Rathian, though, are they are tough. They are tough yeah. monsters, yeah. But today we also revealed Silver Rathalos and Gold Rathalos. Damn, this is bringing me back to three use so hard. <laughs> These monsters. Oh, an MR10. Easy, <laughs> easy. <laughs> Ooh, the roar. The last time we saw wow. Narga Kuga yeah. was in Monster Jesus, Hunter Jesus, how's it been nine years? God. So it's been a while. It lives in a new locale that we're adding in the update, the Forlorn Arena. That looks beautiful. Its distinguishing feature is that it can use its bright white fur to refract moonlight, allowing it to become invisible. Does that mean that it's tied to that area? Invisible. Camilio That's the only place we've, we've been able to fight it, so I guess so. Narga Kuga okay. is much more agile. And the trails left by its red eyes. Yeah, that's the a, that's the coolest the part of it, dude. It's oh, like yeah. you see the red eyes just shifting around, like, oh god, I'm gonna die. <laughs> In terms of visuals, the designers took great care to preserve yeah. the atmosphere. Yeah, 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 looks good. Lookout, while adding new elements and interpretations to the ambience and background, among other things. <sighs> Mm. You know, I, I've never found Basil to be a very Seeming engaging fight. Piece. It's a cool Hunter fight. It's a cool monster design. Right, right, But the right. fight itself isn't my favorite. I usually avoid it just because I don't have a lot of fun with it. Much more right. Dangerous. It seems like a very, like, once you have, like, the rhythm it to him, it's kind of... Extra powerful state where it yeah. But the, the ceiling was a little bit more fun. At which point, it will start showering the area with critically volatile scales. Man... There we go. I want to learn more about these guys. If I wonder if they're going to be exactly the same as three of you. We'll see. 
they can go into a powerful incandescent state. Onyx, they weren't in Ice Bar? Attacking even more ferocious. I shit, were they? I don't remember. I don't remember. I think either. they might have. I think they might have been. You'll find them quite challenging. They because they're, they're they're kind of sort of a state. Kind of. Uh-huh. The armor you can forge from the materials Ooh. of the monsters added in version 11. That male face might look cool for the seating. Mm -hmm. as well. so look at that. Wow. Oh, Several of those look sick. That looks cool. There we go. Explanation. Let's go. Some of you may already be playing this, but I'd like to do a quick breakdown of anomaly. <laughs> it's like, listen, just in case y'all don't know what this is. After Spoilers for everybody who hasn't story. finished <laughs> Macho Hunter Rex's story. <laughs> and raise your master rank to 10. You'll be able to take on new quests called Anomaly Damn, quests. You're, you're making me really think if they were on Iceborne, I don't remember. Oh, I, I, dude, I have no idea. I'm going to look it up real quick. Do it, man. I devoured, like, the majority of Iceborne. I didn't finish it 100%, but that was in prep for this game. I'm pretty sure they were. Yeah, Gold Rathian was in there. Yeah. Roll of Silver Lows. In Anomaly Quest. In the current version of the game, version 10, you can play Anomaly Yeah, Silver Lowe's was in there too. Four okay. right. Star rank. I, 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 By completing they were... a certain quest at Master Rank 50 or higher. Yeah, yeah, they were there for sure. You can use the unique material. Oh shit, this is... Oh. oh no, they're still going over the... No, yeah, yeah, the regular stuff okay. yeah. Yeah, I thought that that was like the stuff that they teased on Twitter. Yeah, I mean, they definitely have to go over that. Definitely. <laughs> for sure. Currently works in version 10. There we go. Anomaly research quests. What the heck? I'm curious. <laughs> Starting from Tidal Update version 11, the quests surrounding afflicted monsters will greatly expand. We've added four new elements for hunters who are looking for something to sink their teeth in. Mm-hmm. God. I'm not looking forward to these, but I Dude. am. Dude, I am. <laughs> Let's start with the regular anomaly quest. Oh my god, Anomaly Diablos. Oh. That's going to be fun. You'll be able to take on new afflicted monsters, such as Luna Garen and Magma Alder. Much better fight than regular Anomaly Drone. Eight Agreed. Eight star monsters will be unlocked through Anomaly Investigation, of which I will tell you more about in a moment. So we hope you... Dude, Zenogre... I, I, Zenogre is tough I'm not, in, I'm not, in Master I, Rank. I, I know! I know, man. I'm not looking forward to it. I hate Zenogre. <laughs> I, I love him, but I hate him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's tough. The beefiest new addition to this update are Anomaly Investigations. The beefiest. Anomaly Investigations have a set level. And as that level increases, the monsters become gradually stronger. And the rewards you can earn will change. The quest condition like the target monster and number of players number oh my god yeah it's like the, the investigations from world random. but these are level based i guess and you can earn yeah. special materials for completing these investigations that open up new upgrades for your weapons and armor. you know i haven't even fought a uh a kazu in in some break yet i only did it a couple times the materials you earn from anomaly investigation yeah, can be used that's for cool, man. This is what I want to see. Equipment. A rampage slot upgrade. That's huge, dude. Pick a stat oh. you want to upgrade, mm. like attack power or affinity. Dude. Then pick a combination to upgrade. Oh, you can do more than just one thing. Armor can be upgraded with random improvements. Oh, to random. Oh. Defense, resistance, and skill. Damn. I can I have that RNG, baby. These uh... I mean, I guess it's okay. That matches your personal play style. <laughs> I would have liked to for it to not be random, but that's fine. In the new anomaly research, gotta keep you playing, right? Gotta keep you grinding for that perfect combination. You'll be able to exchange the items you gain from anomaly investigation for items that are useful for curious craft. Okay. No, simple enough. So the the investigations are random, random mm -hmm. sets of of of. The quest ranks and monsters uh, that appear for anomaly quests, as well as the level cap for anomaly investigations, so there, oh, cool. will be expanded. Okay, so it's so like random parameters, item. and then depending on how hard or how high the level is, the better rewards, pretty much. Mm -hmm, Uses mm -hmm. to upgrade stuff randomly. Right. Here's some more information right. on other, other updates. For more details, please visit our official website and social media. I wonder if these are going to be the same as before. After update version nice 11, 
we will start releasing event quests, kicking off on August 18th. We God, Two Furious Rajang looks like hell. Every week with a variety of <laughs> one alone was like. So we hope you look forward yeah, one's tough. One's tough. I was surprised that More I got the, the rewards after the second fight. We made available on our official website. <laughs> Dude, I was like, media. yes, I'm done. Anyway, <laughs> we are also introducing some extra <laughs> dual threats. Event <laughs> two of each. Oh my no God, this this is. Oh, that's gonna be beautiful. To hunt two monsters <laughs> like Silver Rathalos and Gold Rathian at the same Oh my God, Onyx, this looks so bad. If you're looking for a solid challenge, yeah. I can't wait. <laughs> event quest can be claimed by going to the courier at your base yeah. and selecting yeah. add-on content. Paid DLC. The T. After update version 11, we will also start selling new DLC. <laughs> For instance, we will be adding layered armor. That makes your character look exactly <laughs> like certain NPCs. You can equip the Fear Rain layered armor. To make oh. your character look exactly like her, including all of her features. Regardless of which body type. <laughs> so you want to be Fiorain? Just be Fiorain. <laughs> we will also sell Fiorain's voice as a DLC on the same day, so you can turn your character entirely into her. No task is too great for me. That's so we'll weird. Other layered armor for your I played it with the Japanese well. voice. Over. Yeah, yeah. Of gestures, same. Stickers, hairstyles. And piano that mohawk. Of the BGM, like what you're hearing now. Oh, nice. I like Malzano's like the Nintendo song. Like yeah, music. That really, was really, really, really good. good. Yeah. But where can you hear it? for the basses? Oh, basses! Dude, if they if they add the three the three U or four U bass music, I'm buying it. Oh yeah, I'm buying it. Yeah. Nostalgia, baby. Some more info. If you already own Monster Hunter Rise and just want to buy Sunbreak. All you have to do is buy the digital version. Yeah, that's of what I did. Right. <laughs> that's what I did. Uh, the, the, I think this is the end of it. They're just going over like, hey, yeah. you want to buy the game? You can purchase the Here's how you do it. it. I almost bought the physical version of it while I was overseas. Oh yeah, they added it. It was, it was just there, and I was just like, mm, should I? Should I not? I decided not to. Kind of wish I did. Completing the seven star hub quest, Serpent Goddess of Thunder. God, that seems like so long ago. If you're completely new to Rise, a year ago, man. Seriously, crazy to think about. S set for free, which will help you get through low and amazing fight, like in terms of like fun. music. We've also added yeah, new yeah, yeah. The atmosphere was freaking awesome. Freaking the voice, so like sure the chorus and everything. Too. It's good. Yeah. To recap. The free title I hate. Yeah. I hate, and I also appreciate that they give us so much information. Like it's front heavy. Uh huh. Because I always, I always want like the one more thing, but I, they never do it. And that's okay. Title update two in store for you. But we gave uh, like we got a bunch of stuff. Yeah. Those are gonna spin us in the title update two. The top picture. I'll take your word for it. Looks like it. Uh, I, Thank you for tuning in. You know so much more about this stuff than I do, man. Special program. Arigato. See you next time. That's it. Bye. <laughs> Happy, Happy hunting. Happy hunting. That's good. <laughs> yeah, that was good, man. Yeah, solid. Today's program solid. has ended. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So, what'd you think, man? Yeah, like 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 I said, there there all these are always as an event, right? Let's just talk about the event. Right. Alone. As an yeah. event, these are all very front heavy. They show a lot of the cool right. stuff at first. And they kind of go into the whatever. So it kind of like winds you down. Like, okay, right. I'm calm, I'm chilling, whatever. Which is cool. I don't have to end everything in a super hype thing. It's fine. Um, but it was good. Uh, four, yeah. uh, four monsters. I think people were speculating Silver Lows and, and Golden Wrath for a while now. Right. Um, I don't know why they were speculating those. I don't know if there was something that may have been data mined or something that um, gave like hints towards that. I don't know. Okay. But I know that uh, people were speculating it. So I had read that once, but I just kind of put in the back of my head so i didn't really mm -hmm. think about them when i saw the title update when i saw them i'm like oh yeah that's right <laughs> so I, very welcome addition and it makes sense in in 3u right. uh you only fought them in that forlorn area as well mm -hmm. okay um, so you know that's kind of cool they're bringing them back but mm -hmm. yeah it, it looks good um losing narcuga looks great i saw they added Dude, some amazing. new moves which makes sense nine amazing. years it made sense they would add something new to them and also the the lows in Rathian. so that's gonna be some pretty pretty cool fights i think yeah, no, I agree with you, man. I'm I'm definitely excited for it. Lucent is gonna be. Uh, I'm yeah. excited, man. I'm so excited. I can't wait to like give it a go and you know. No, for sure, for sure. 
What was right, it? Man. You said uh, um, hunt it, carve it, and wear it? Hunt it, carve it, wear it. What a Hunt it, carve it, wear it. Where's our... Oh, yeah. man. Anyways, guys, let us know what you think in the comments below. What are you excited about out of all the four monsters? If not, just all four. Let me know. And uh, yeah. I guess we'll see you on the next one. Later, guys. Peace. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more and stay up to date, subscribe, hit the little bell, and join our Discord. If you want to support the channel, please check out our Patreon or hit the join button below. As always, thanks for your support and thanks for watching.